In my seemingly endless quest for convenient ways of loading software, I recently bought one of these, which is USB cable to 3.5mm jack. And the reason I got this was so that I could use some software on my phone, plug this into my phone, because my phone, surprisingly, doesn't have a jack on it anymore, and connect it up to my Spectrum. Now, two things in relation to that. The first one is it made my phone and the connector really hot. And I don't know if that's because I should have been using a mono connection rather than stereo, which this one is. But I didn't think it'd make a difference. And the second thing is it just didn't work anyway. So before my phone caught fire, I got rid of it. Well, stopped using it. So big brain that I am, it got me thinking, what if I could use Bluetooth? And with a quick search of eBay, four pounds spent and a few days passing, I got this, a generic Bluetooth board <clears throat> with connectors on it that I won't need. And somebody's already gone to the trouble of soldering on signal wire and supply wires to it. And we've got some sticky pads as well. So there's nothing special about this board in terms of it being workable with the Spectrum. Install it inside somewhere to be determined. Hopefully then with my phone connected to this, I'll be able to send whatever I want. It'll come through on the board and then the Spectrum will think it's just coming in as normal on the audio jack. So a brilliant, simple idea. Let's get it installed and see if it works.
So let's wrap this video up then. Is a Bluetooth adapter for the Spectrum any good? Yes, I think it's absolutely brilliant. It's a bit of a halfway house when you consider the SD storage, which loads instantly. Where is this thing? It, it loads as it loads, doesn't it? Just like a tape. I think it adds another option rather than using tapes, which we all know the problems with that. And it doesn't alter the physical appearance, which is quite important to me. And it's also a heck of a lot better than that thing that I got. And at four pounds, that's about the same price of this tub of gummy snakes. But unlike this tub of gummy snakes, I'm hoping that that Bluetooth adapter lasts an awful lot longer. I hope you've enjoyed this video. And if you'd like to support my channel and my addiction to gummy snakes, then there's a link in the description. Meanwhile, thank you for watching and I hope to see you again soon. Bye for now.